It is 100 seconds to midnight. The bearers of unbearable news. Time is almost up until the world is doomed. The hand of this fateful clock has been placed at various positions since its inception more than 70 years ago. But in 2018, it was set at two minutes to midnight. The closest since 1953, at the height of the Cold War. Now the Nobel laureate studded panel has moved it 100 seconds before a climate catastrophe. Without U.S. leadership and participation, there will be no winners from this climate crisis. We will all become losers. The world's second biggest polluter is being called out. At the World Economic Forum in Switzerland, the U.S. Treasury Secretary told 17-year-old climate activist Greta Thunberg she should go to college and study economics before calling for an end to fossil fuels. This is not the doom and gloom issue, okay, that is going to impact everybody in the next 10 years. Here, the stark contrast between planet and profit was on display. <laughs> for the first time in the history of humankind, there is a limit, a physical limit, to our perspectives of development. And nature is striking back. Australia is also featuring in the global conversation. The UK's meteorological office says recent bushfires accounted for one-fifth of an unprecedented global increase in carbon dioxide emissions projected this year. Even if the night is darkest before the dawn, the message is becoming clear. By then, it will be too late. Randolph Nogle, ABC News.